Hey gang, I think we need to have a discussion of what is success in the music business. My name's Big Ed, I've been making records for 32 years as an artist, producer, songwriter, bandmate. Let's get through this together. Okay, so what is success? I was thinking about this, I was talking to a manager friend of mine, and he's like, hey, why are you moving to London? And I said, well, I have a very successful group over there, or at least a fairly successful group, and you know, there's, there's other people relying on me, and I'm here, and they're there, and it's unfair, and of course, COVID kind of, you know, tamped down that pretty well. And then he's like, well, what do you mean by success? And I said, well, we sell out every record that we press and we sell out every gig we do. And he's like, oh, wow, yeah, that's really good. And as a manager, he can respect that that's a pretty, pretty good track record. However, what is success to you? To me, that's success, even though I've been doing this for 32 years, I just you know, I want to I want to press records. I want to sell as many of them as possible, and I want to move people at our live performances and bring more people out every time. And ideally, yeah, sell out the the gigs that we play. And so, to me, that's success. But that's success on a smaller level, right? Because you know, if you're selling a few thousand records and you're selling out a club that holds 200 people. That to me seems pretty good, but that's not what some people are looking for. So what is success for you? And the reason I'm asking this question is you have to gauge where you belong in the hierarchy of the business, because as we all know, if you're not Post Malone or Taylor Swift, you're not getting most of the attention. So it's hard to carve out a following, it's hard to carve out any attention for your music and the press and, and for gigs if you're not at that level. Well, guess what? There's a dozen people at that level. That's it, right? Pretty much. And everybody else is below that. So you have to figure out where you fit in there and start working your way up that ladder if that's what you desire. Or, you you know, this is why I'm, I'm asking you is maybe you want to be halfway up that ladder. Maybe you want to be a third of the way up, you know. Maybe your music's good enough to get almost to the top and that would be fantastic too but your expectations, what are your expectations and are they reasonable? I've always tried to you know, control my expectations and keep them fairly reasonable because that's how you build. To me, that's how you build. And that's how I built my career as a singer songwriter. I started out playing to like coffee clubs, you know, like it was like, you know, maybe 50 people in the crowd and then there was 150 people and there was 300 people. Honestly, that's the way it built. And then I got signed to a record deal and then I was selling records, but I wasn't selling enough for the record label. And yet, when we'd go play shows, we were still doing really well. So, you know, temper your expectations around what you think are achievable and what you can build on. It might be that you get to a certain level and you hit a ceiling, but that might be okay too, because you might be making a living. And again, if you have a day job, trust me on this, Keep your day job. Try to do music as long as you can with your day job. Don't be a knucklehead like me who was like, ooh, I signed a record deal, boom, I quit my day job. Use that money, use that towards your passion, all right? So just think about your expectations and where you belong, and also think about like what type of music are you doing? If you're playing jazz, you're obviously not gonna compete with them up there. If you're playing folk rock or, or Americana, you're not gonna keep with them up there. You're gonna be somewhere down here. So just to kind of figure out where you fit in and, and adjust your expectations. Don't adjust your dreams. Still shoot for the stars, but adjust your expectations so you can gradually build on that and work your way up the ladder, okay?